Welcome to another Field of Glory 2 historical battle. This is Kunaxa, 401 BC. Uh, this is a battle in which Xenophon and the 10,000 participated. Uh, I am commanding the army of Artaxerxes, which was opposed to Cyrus and, of course, Xenophon and his fellow Greek mercenaries. Looks like... Let's see... We have numerical superiority, but the infantry is no match for hoplites. If either of the royal brothers is killed, the other will inevitably win the battle and secure the throne of Persia for himself. Great, so don't let the CNC get killed. Got it. Hoplites. Yeah. Not sure what to do about that. I think I will try to use these side to chariots to slow down the hoplites with their zone of control. In the meantime, we'll want to take advantage of this hill, even though it'll only be of limited use, given that the Takabara foot are glorified irregular foot facing off against armored hoplites. That kind of thing tends not to go well. like we'll win the skirmishing. Not that that's really very important. Okay, hoplites. Oh wait, these are not armored, they are protected. This make a huge difference. Four to four for light cavalry, five non light as opposed to six. Probably shift more Iranian cavalry over to the right wing. I might even shift, let's see, none of these have bows, unfortunately. Cirrus over to a protected unit so we can get these armored cavalry into the fray. out of his direct arc of fire so he doesn't get the stationary shooting bonus. Okay. Do I have any need to do anything else yet? I'm going to get more scythe chariots over to face the hoplites. And I also might try to stretch the line with the infantry as well. Next turn.
Oh, as long as we break even on all this, I'm not that concerned. Keep adjusting everyone over here and keep falling back here. That should do for now. Next turn. Rally on the lights. Yeah, this I wish they could find a way to code out. I'm kind of waiting. But it's not the end of the world. I wonder why you didn't just charge there. Alright, good shout. And go for that disruption. Again. Good. Right now, that should be a good spot for the chariots. You keep working your way down. Get out. Break. Good. Held firm. Go for a frag. Guess not. Too bad. I was hoping to go for the frag and break, but there you go. Do we engage with the cavalry? Yeah, let's get started. Firm. Get close enough that a charge would not be worth it. Oh, we have bow on two units, huh? Well, let's keep them closer to the action than what am I doing there. Good. Finish lining that unit up. Very good. Okay, anything else to do? Not really. Uh, maybe we do start advancing here. Ah, right. 
Next turn, then, we can begin a general advance on the right. Keep holding back on the left. Next turn. Oh, well, let's inch closer, threading a charge, and then see what happens with the evasions. Good. Not quite a catch. Oh, that's okay. Work on a disruption if possible. They are only protected after all. Hold firm. And now we have to follow up to cover the cavalry. Go for the break. Come on, don't be like that. Good. I would follow up on that, but unfortunately there is now cavalry nearby. Let's at least punish them for approaching so close. for a break. How about actually doing your job? Good. Nope. All right. Turn and face the oncoming hoplites. One more volley at the lights. Start inflicting a few casualties. Not that it'll do much good. Say we're committed then. Next turn. Good. If he's halting, we're just going to keep shooting, really.
Okay. I am tempted to get the Immortals forward into Bowshot. But that invites the Hoplites, and we get sucked in here, and I'm not really interested in doing that yet. doomed so bye okay turn around and shoot again Chasing you. Good. That flank in. Well, we held firm, so it could have been worse. All right. I'm not sure to be relieved, relieved or concerned the hoplites have halted. On the one hand, it means that if I attack a bar, I don't have to face them. On the other hand, it means that if things start up here, I might get sucked into the flat ground. Next turn. Yeah, that makes sense. Come the ten thousand. Though I don't know if they actually number ten thousand here. Right, well, let's keep putting some hurt on this cavalry and zone it from charging us. Don't 
do we want to waste arrows on them, to be honest? Hmm. Let's keep encouraging some forward movement. Good. Can we inflict 28 casualties? Not likely, but possible. Nope. Okay. Then what? Well, let's give these a shove and see. Oh yeah, is that worth it? Probably, but let's hold the command back. Good. Can't quite reach. Well, that's all right, none of this matters anyway. Shove them off map. Zone them in. Actually, we'll use a cheaper cavalry for that. Going for impact. Well, I wasn't expecting that, but I'll take it. They are unarmored. Well, they're protected instead of armored. Zone them in and pour in some arrows. Good. And keep moving forward. Great, so we'll keep pushing our advantage here and holding off here and just trying to delay the Greeks as much as possible. Next turn. Oh, I'm disappointing. Maybe we'll be able to... Oh, hello. I can work with that. Okay, we can't get Artaxerxes killed. <laughs> Why didn't they fall back? Hmm, well, my clever plan is looking less clever now. That sort of thing tends to happen. Great. Well, let's try. Nope, 
Not quite. Do we bother shooting at the Takabara foot? No, I'd rather shoot at the Hoplites. They're an actual threat. This charge is not very good. Yeah, light spear plus 50, superior plus 50. It's an even uh, even chance on the charge. Well, that's too bad. In the meantime, though, we can pile onto the flank here. Join the fun. It's pretty much a guaranteed kill there. Work on this cavalry. I might have set up a flank on myself here, but I don't know if I really care that much. I guess I could do that to prevent it. Good, then what? Let's go for the charge. A break. <laughs> Let's take advantage. Good. And further attempt to take advantage. Do I even bother shooting here? Is that worth it? It might be. They hold firm. Screw it. Just charge. You might catch him. You super didn't. Good job. You lot. Uh, don't know if I want to get involved yet. Got this flank tile covered. I don't think we need to move up anymore. Causing some good chaos here. Next turn. That very good. Hoping for cohesion checks. Well, let's uh, inspire the troops then. No frag. Hmm. Arc your way around. Go for impact. Go for impact. Hold firm. Shove them off the map. We'll probably be back, but. Hopefully it'll take a little while. Hmm. Ah, I suppose we might as well do that then. 
Good. It's kind of an awkward situation. Here, Lucimeros. Good. Could I just charge here and see if we just pursue right past? I don't know if we could do anything with that, but that's yeah, worth a try. Oh no. Cool. Nice job, guys. Well done. Shove them along, see what happens with the cavalry. Hmm. Well, that wasn't ideal. Some even fights here. Nice. Set up the flank and prevent them from preventing it. Grind down these cavalry. Okay, and uh, this whole situation. Shoot at these hoplites. Try again. Held firm. It's too bad. How is that? It's not wonderful. The real question is, should I be pushing out here to set up a flank on these guys, or just sit here on my hill? I'm kind of inclined to sit on my hill. Yeah, let's keep it up with the sitting on the hill business, at least for a turn. What we can do is threaten flanks from both directions if we get pushed back. Could also switch command towards the hill. Okay, not bad, but still pretty early. Next turn. Where is Sirius's command unit anyway? Entirely lost track. Good. You'll have to cover that. Uh, he did it to go for that. Not a bad idea. Yeah, should have done that first in case they broke so he could have rolled it. Trying to set up a flank, we'll have to cover with zone of control or to sacrifice them. We 
we need to cover that. Come on, push them back. Nope. All right. Once again, let's see if we get pushed back. We don't. Here, loose some arrows. Zone them in. Let's see what this does for us. Anything good? Not bad. Take a hit, but in exchange we should be able to get a flank. Ugh. Fact. Try for that. Hold on. No, that seems unnecessary. Let's let them come in a little bit more. Might be able to surround. Alright, what does that do for us? Absolutely nothing. Well, maybe we see how this goes before deciding whether we want to cover. I would want to reinforce a success after all. How the hell with it? Yeah, it's worth it. That's worth it. We'll lose a unit now. Oh, maybe two. Let's try for impact. Very good. Should we try again? go here, I can go for the cavalry. Do I want to go for the cavalry, though? Hmm. Yeah, I do. Send them in. Threat a flank. Double drop. Uh, held firm. Well. Flank again, and do I dare? Let's do it. 
That was not very nice. Okay. They'll evade because we have a rear charge threat behind them. And now we can charge. And if we're lucky, they'll break and we can pursue through, but it looks like that's not going to be the case. Threaten a rear charge again. What do we got? Surround. Good. Try to work your way around. Uh huh. useless until this melee breaks up. Right, well Artaxerxes is just going to sit there not doing anything. Kind of stuck here. Try to work our way around maybe? I mean it doesn't matter, if we're pinning a few units with less units it's worth it either way. We'll just sit there. Okay, and you... Bow Cavalry, huh? Great, threaten a charge. If we don't disrupt by fire through by jabs and bow, then we can get a good impact in, hopefully. Next turn. I expect there will be some rallies at some point with this many units running about. Yeah, what I say. Someone just dropped Cohesion, but I have no idea who... Nicely bounced. Yep, that was the sacrifice we made. No effect. Thanks for moving into cohesion check range first. I appreciate it. Well done, well done. So it's interesting, he's not charging here. The side chariots will disperse after a round of melee. I believe they would fall back after impact though, and their impact is pretty fierce, 250 versus any. But I think it would be worth it in this case to charge, bounce him back, and then block this unit from getting the flank in. Not going to do anything about it though. Do I charge? Do I get behind? 
getting behind could be the thing. Yeah, let's try that. Eh, that was not really a huge success. Alright, see if you get pushed back. No. Zone them in again. Fragged. Well, go for the break. No. Out here. Mm, not quite. And not quite. Figured this out. So we fall back out of there. Well, never mind then. Okay, so even if we break here next turn, we'll be able to flank. Oh, who to, who to catch? Let's see what that does first. Uh-huh. Oh, it's tempting. It's tempting. But ultimately, we should probably rescue our cavalry. Nicely done. Excellent. Gotta say, some really great dice rolls this turn. Shove past. Good. Okay, so, uh, there's this whole situation, what do we do then? Let's see what this does. Nothing. So we'll prepare a flank here. I try to balance things out, you're also uphill. Alright. Don't want to block this fallback. I suppose we could be minimally irritating here. I would think that we can wrap this next turn. Next turn. Impressive rally by that unit. All 
might bounce us off. Yep. things out a bit. That's all right. Well, Artaxerxes is engaged now. Hopefully he doesn't get himself killed. Double drop on the Takabara foot. I would have just walked past after the first engagement, personally. Now we have an impressive rally in turn. Okay. Well, let's shuffle past here. Uh, maybe like that. There's the frag, and come on, break. Good. Held firm. on. Good. They're close to auto break. Um, here, just shove them along, see where that takes our cavalry. Flank. Okay. Um, get that in. Try again. Good. They both hold firm, so this will just be a straightforward. Ugh, roll the dice. Next up, hmm. Great. Uh, you do not have bows. What about you? Also, no. Get that flank in. Alright, don't die now. Thank you. That'd be a pretty ridiculous way to lose.
you out, you forward, lose this unit of chariots, yep, be generally annoying, that's fine, whatever. And that should be GG now. Oh, so we're getting compliments. Thank you. Very generous. Uh, might be a rally or two, but it shouldn't matter. So, I would say the only serious thing that stood out to me was allowing my scythe chariots to sit there and block the hoplites. I think just tanking a couple of bad charges in order to push past and engage this main line of squishy Takabara foot would have been the way to go. Uh, you did do a little bit of that, but the fact that not everybody was forward at once allowed me to set up these sort of flank attacks and the like. So, next up, I believe, is uh, Chironea, Philip versus the Greek cities. So, good game. And, till next time.